Welcome to my sixth Christmas special. This recipe is called Cinnamon Stars and it's part of my ebook Nine Plant Based Christmas Cookies. We're using aquafaba for the meringue glaze instead of egg white and it works like magic. You cannot taste any chickpeas if you should be worried. So first you need to set two tablespoons of the aquafaba aside in a deep bowl and store it in the fridge until you need it. In your blender add hazelnuts, almonds, dates, cinnamon, salt and the leftover aquafaba. If you're using vanilla essence add this as well. Pulse it into an even dough and you might need to scrape down the sides and repeat. Wrap the dough in cling film and chill in the fridge for 30 minutes up to 24 hours. In the meanwhile we have time to prepare the meringue. So in a deep bowl beat the 2 tablespoons of chilled aquafaba which was sitting in your fridge with the lemon juice to stiff peaks. Add your vanilla and cane sugar into batches and beat it to stiff peaks again. If you rub a tiny amount between your fingers, you can check if the sugar has dissolved. If you can still feel the sugar, you need to beat a bit longer. Put your dough between two layers of cling film and roll it into 5 mm, that's one fourth inch thickness. And with a cookie cutter, cut out your stars. Should your cookie cutter get sticky, you just need to dip it in some cold water every now and then. Next transfer the cookies onto parchment paper and glaze them with a very thin layer, about one half teaspoon of the whipped aquafaba meringue. Bake them on the bottom rack, that's important otherwise they might burn in the oven, for 15 to 20 minutes at 150 degrees Celsius, that's 300 degrees Fahrenheit. You might want to keep an eye on the cookies during the last minutes of baking and take them out before they start browning. If you want to store them, you can use a tin box and you could leave the cookies in the cold oven overnight so they have time to dry out completely, otherwise the meringue tends to get soft again. If you enjoyed this video, you will love the next one as well. And that's all plant based cutout Christmas cookies. All recipes are in my ebook Nine Plant Based Christmas Cookies. And I'm looking forward to seeing you next time. Cut.